So in question number second, the question is asking about find the coordinates of the point of trisection. The word trisection is important. Uh, trisection of the line segment joining four comma minus one and minus two comma minus three. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to draw a rough diagram for me. Four comma minus one minus two minus three. So over here, first point is four comma minus one, and second point is minus two comma minus three. Yes or no? These are the two points. Mm. Yes. And the question is saying this line. So it's it's a line segment, not a line, because we have two endpoints. So this line segment is being divided into three parts: trisection, trisect. Trisect means three equal equal parts. Yeah. So if you don't know, in. yeah. So similarly, the word bisect means two equal parts. Understood? Two equal parts. I'm just erasing this thing. I, I hope you guys know what is trisection called. Now, so uh, that means one point is over here and one point is over here. Diagrammatically, it's a rough diagram, so it's absolutely fine. So in terms of ratio, that means this part is equal to this part equal to this part. Make sense? Yes. Yes. One is to one is to one. So let me just label this thing. This point is A, this point is B, this point is P, this point is Q. Now, what I'm going to do, since I don't know how to do it directly, but first of all, let me tell you, they are asking us to find the coordinate of P, find the coordinate of Q. That is the question. Question is clear, Neil? Yes, sir. Now, one part I am going to do, second part you guys will do. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this point A and point B, and I will just take this point P. Yeah. Okay. Now, this is, these are the two points. I need to find this X comma Y. What is the ratio? What one is, is the to ratio? Two. A one P is to two. P B. See, yes. this part is, this part is one. So what I'm going to do right over here, one is two. Now these two parts are coming together. So this is yes. two. understood now. So, so ratio is one is to two. Now you can do that, use that section formula, the Chappi formula, which I shared. Oh. Remember this formula yes. I will take. Yes. For X, I will just do the cross, crisscross thing to find the value of X. So I'll do one question. So for X, this will go and get multiplied by X. So two bracket four plus this one will go and multiply with X. So one bracket minus two. Always write down the step. Otherwise write down the formula. And at the bottom, we will add the ratio for one plus two. Okay. So what is the answer for X? So eight minus two upon three. Answer is six upon three. That is two. Mm. So my X value is two. So similarly for Y, let's do it quickly. Similarly, two will get multiplied by minus one. And... Uh, one, one will get multiplied by minus three. Minus three. So answer is minus two minus three upon three minus five upon three. Minus five upon three. Therefore, my p coordinate is uh, two comma five upon three. Minus minus five upon three. So I'm not going to do it for q. You guys have to do it. For Q, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take again point A, point B, and this time I will take point Q. 
what is the ratio now? Two is to one. Very good. Two is to one. Please draw this diagram and do this thing as your homework. And you can take a screenshot of this thing. Okay.